What's up you guys? I am back with a new video and I now have four binders. And instead of the one that you saw in my first video and I'll put it in the cards somewhere on this screen. So yeah, I wanted to give you an overview of my binders and then get to cash stuffing. So normally I kept my cash in this right here. As you can see, I have cash in it, but I just recently bought this right here. This is my new wallet binder and this will go into my purse. All these that you see are from Amazon. Literally everything you see here is from Amazon. The links will be down in the description for everything. But first, this one is just a glitter binder. You open it up and you have, or I have, groceries, gas, household, shopping, miscellaneous, and just a blank one that I need to still label. I just haven't felt like bringing up my Cricut. So there's my wallet binder. Then I have my, this is my high priority binder. This one is as well off of Amazon and it is glitter. And I think this one's rose gold. So in this one, I have ho-ho season. So that's Christmas, that's high priority because Christmas is like a month away basically. Health, this one's right now for my eye appointments that I have and new glasses and contacts but any other time it'd technically be like anything health related like if we need some like medicines Tylenols whatever the reason why we don't like have medical bill technically is because we my husband is active duty and I was also active duty so everything's pretty much paid for no Lamborghinis is like car maintenance stuff and I'm gonna stuff this one pretty good because my blinker just went out like literally yesterday Bills, this one is, um, I want to be one month ahead on bills, but I just want the short route and they would have bills. Insurance, I want to be able to pay my full six months premium because I can save money. So I'm going to save up for that and stuff this pretty largely because I'm already, I think, two months into my six month premium. And then debt, I want to save up as much as I can to put like a nice chunk of money into either my car or some other debt and then this one right here is um i think this one was taxes and then i forget what this one was but i'll have to look at my little binder but yeah this one is my high priority and the folders in this may change because you know you can do that with budgeting it's you're personal and things in this may change because once I get all my car stuff done that's not really a priority anymore technically so this is my low priority binder there is quite a few in here but some of them I'd like to save up for for in the future so I have phone this is low priority because we just got new phones New car, this is not necessarily something we're working towards right as of now, but we would like to get a new car or a second car, most likely a second car. Moving, uh, we're not moving anytime soon that I know of, but in the military, you're always moving, so it will come up eventually. House repairs, I don't have any house repairs that I know of. This is for the house that we own in North Carolina. There's none that I know of, but I'm sure there will be in the future, so there's that. Family fun is family fun if we want to go to an aquarium, museum, or, you know, just go to the movies or whatever it may be. Family fun. New outfits. This is for my husband and I. We both need a new clothes desperately, but it's not one of the priorities in this moment. Vacation. This is one of the new ones I added. The ones that have no money in it are the ones I added, but vacation, it's not necessarily like a whole huge vacation. Maybe like, I don't know, one day we wanna go to Kansas City or something. Boom, we'll have the money. Pet care is for my dog, and I probably won't stuff this because I literally just bought his food today. He has plenty of toys, he has plenty of treats, so 
very good. So maybe like a few dollars. I don't know. This one, I forget what this one was for, but I need to make more labels. And then this one looks kind of crazy. This is just one for literally all these like holidays, um, birthdays. We won't use it as much, but it'd still be nice to have it because I know we went to the pumpkin fest or not a, a pumpkin fest, a um, pumpkin patch. And that would have been nice to have some money because we kind of like scrounged up some money to be able to go. I actually donated plasma to be able to go to this. And then gift cards. This is obvious. If I get any gift cards, I'll put it in here. I like to save up my Target gift cards that I get because I do the diaper deals. And then when it's a time that I really need it or even for Christmas or birthday, I have a gift card. So... This is my low priority binder. And if you want to see me putting all these together and how I did it, you can go to my TikTok. It is galford.fam and I'll put it down the bottom of the screen. And it'll also be in the description. Then this one was the original budget binder, but I don't, I don't know. I like the way the clear ones look better. So yeah, switched. And then this one is the kids binder. Yes, I have a specific one for the kids. This is my daughter. As of now, I'm just gonna be putting like extra ones every time I stuff it, like the ones that we don't use. I'm just gonna throw in here. Obviously for my son, I'll just kind of divvy them up. If I have four ones, two in here and two in here. If I have one extra, I'll show you that in a minute. Then clothing for them because kids outgrow clothes a lot and my daughter actually needs some 12 month clothes. So we are gonna stock in that one. Back to school, neither one of my kids are in school yet, but I would like to have money stay, saved up. Even if I plan to homeschool, I'd still like to have money saved up for a little bit of school supplies, activities, and stuff like that. This one is for allowances and chores because my mom always paid me for my chores and like gave me like a little allowance. So that's what I'm gonna do with my son and my daughter because my son loves money already. So rest in peace to my sanity with that. And then this folder right here just kind of holds like the money that I need to stuff. So we're going to go ahead and take that out because this is what I'm going to stuff. Or if I have any extra ones that I can't divide up between the kids, I put in here as well. I might actually move this one to my high priority binder because that makes more sense. So yeah, again, if you want to see me doing all these binders, go over to my TikTok and you can see me setting all these bad boys up. Okay, we're going to start with my wallet binder. We're going to start off with that because that's kind of the most priority thing. First, we're going to count the money and kind of sort the money. I'm going to put it over here because it's, yeah. So we got 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, we got 130, 131, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 40, 41, 42, 43, so 143, and if I counted that wrong, I'm sorry. So, first we're going to start out with the money in this, got a... $1. And this was used for my groceries. So it is, it's scarce. It's, it's honestly scarce. So normally I'll put this one in the kids and this change in my change jar, but I am actually going to keep it in here just because I'm going to need to be getting a $5 or a five gallon jug and I want to fill it up and not have to put like a 20 or a 10 in there. I just can use my ones and change. So I don't know if I said this, but this one will hold my coins. I need to make a label for it. So I'm actually going to put these in there because I can actually use this right here for to fill it up at least one gallon until I get my five gallon. And it's like 35 cents a gallon, so that's why I want to use that. So, for groceries, we're going to put this one in there. And then, I'm just going to do a five, 
six, seven. I know that doesn't seem like a lot, but we don't really need groceries. And my husband has money as well. So we don't really need a whole lot. We just pretty much got groceries. This is kind of like a little bit of extra money. Do I like it like this? Ooh, that barely fits. Ooh, that barely fits, but whatever. Okay, gas. Um, I'm not gonna put anything because my husband has gas money. Household is like toilet toiletries. I just didn't feel like doing toiletries, so I don't think I need any toiletries right now. So I'm just going to be putting a five because I probably will when my in-laws come. And if not, I'll just put this somewhere else if I don't end up using it. Shopping, I'm not 100% sure what I wanna do with this one, if I'm being honest. My husband still has his money, so we're good there. This is for like gift cards, coupons, blah, 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 blah. And then this is that. So there's not much going in this right now. Groceries, the reason why I didn't put much in there because groceries comes from my husband's paycheck and then this is what I got mostly from school because I do get paid for going to school because military. Next we're gonna move on to high priority. I kind of hate thinking about these because I don't, I just don't. So this has 40 already in it because I marked it here. I might actually get rid of those, I don't know. But since it already has 40 and I have those two, diff two gift cards and all of that, I don't know. I'll just go ahead and throw another 20 in there. If I don't use it, it can roll over or I can use it for my son's birthday. So that's 20, 40, 60 in ho-ho season or Christmas. <laughs> needs a break in okay health what do i have in here i have 40 so let's see here come on 40 50 60 70 80 because i know i need at least 80 in for my eye appointment so we're gonna stuff that so i know i have that because my eye appointment's like i think the 14th of November. No lumber feeties. It has 20. We're gonna put 30 in there because I need an oil change. And whatever comes from my husband's stuff that he doesn't use because he hasn't been going to work that much. We'll see what happens there. And let me, I'm trying to see what I want to stuff. Debt, I'm not going to stuff. I forget what these two were. Taxes and something. So, 10, 15, 20. So, this one was taxes. So, we're going to put... 5, 10, 15, 20 in there. And I'm just coming up with these numbers in my head, guys, if I'm being honest. I forget what this one's for, but whatever. No lemon fees. I did that one, right? Yeah, I did. Turns out we are not going to stuff the low priority this check because like I said there was only like a hundred dollars so I figured out what this one was this last one here was um house restock so for things that you might not want will need to buy all the time so like a shower curtain I don't know like kind of stuff like that and then yeah so we're going to Second, we're going to put five. And two bills or not. 
insurance. So we're going to put five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I know that's not a lot, but like I said, we're not working with a lot right now. We'll just put these one, two, three, four, five, and six into house restock. And I'm not sure if I want to actually have my budget trackers in here. So these little things right here, I'm not sure if I even want those in here or not. And if I do, I might actually laminate them and put them in between. I don't even think I want these because I'm sure I'll be counting this every time I do this. So, there you have it. Didn't really stock much, but this, pic this one was low. I'm just getting started back. And this is realistic, guys. As real as it gets. Um, we are a low income family. That's one of the reasons why I actually started school is because I know I get paid from it. So yeah, I hope you like this video and if you want to see more, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below and I will also make a playlist that has all my cash stuffing videos. So if you don't like the other stuff that's on my channel, you can just click that playlist and you can see me stuffing all these binders. I hope you guys like this video. Bye. Mwah. It won't go away I've got that feeling rushing through my body I know